All right, welcome back to the David Show. I'm gonna heal my guys. So we still have Matt and Tom here. Hey guys. Yeah. <laughs> I, I wasn't lying. I wasn't. <laughs> we could do one where we all do each other's voice. <laughs> How would that work? No. I, no yeah, We're not this, doing. This is, I'll, I'll be David. So this is for the, the David rest of the Show. It's not the Tom Show. You can do it on the Tom gotta, Show. Now. Yeah. Yeah, you're gonna be jealous in the Tom show. It's way you more master, like, viewers. just master, like, an impression of me, so it just sounds like. Like, what? <laughs> what am I doing? David show. <laughs> this is the David show. They're like, oh my god, David is on the show. <laughs> Pretty good, David. God, I don't want to run into another one of those big bird Ultra dudes. Guys. So how does uh, how does the magic work in this? Like leveling up your magic skills. Oh, okay, so it's not like experience points. We there's a thing called the sphere grid, okay. and you collect sphere. It's pretty, and you just you'll gain like sphere levels from each fight, and then oh, so it's kind yeah. of almost like in Diablo how you have a skill tree. Pretty much, yeah, you can choose which way you want your guys to go, so like, let me get out of this, so walk, that's walk is progression, um, and it, it's really hard, you can fill up the entire grid later with like the side quests, but right now, it's uh, oh god, Riku just sucks, <laughs> she's the last person you get, so she, and she starts out just as bad as everyone else does, so like late in the game, is when you get her and she sucks because she's really weak. <laughs> so now she's like the weakest one because everyone else is like leveled Yeah, up. so you have to actually kind of spend a lot of time to get her like strong, like caught up to everybody. <clears throat> and when you do that, everyone else gets stronger, so she'll always be the, the weakest. <laughs> but that's pretty much it. Yeah. didn't use anyone else and just used her. Like the whole rest of the game. Oh, that she would be she would lose. She would die. She dies like in one hit. So, <laughs> and she can't even. Yeah, I mean, I guess you could go back to the. Well, there's no way to transport from like town to town right now, so yeah. you'd have to do a lot of backtracking, which you can't at this point. We're in a desert, and we don't know how we got here. So, let me. Uh, this bird is giving me a lot of problems again. <laughs> Waka sucks. He's supposed to be my guy that hits aerial creatures. The, this dude with a ball back there. He's not doing jack shit. I gotta, I'm gonna just keep leveling him up. So yeah, you get the sphere levels. That determines how far you can move on the grid. And then when you kill guys, you get different spears too. So I'm I'm doing a t like a terrible job of explaining that, but <laughs> <laughs> I, I got the the, basic the gist. gist of it. Yeah. So like in the end, it's just like <clears throat> leveling up. It just <laughs> requires a bit more. Uh, <laughs> a bit more finesse. It, it, yeah, it feels like you're actually like doing something. I feel like there's a lot of like that's what she said in like all of the directions. Just inserting you, things in absences. And <laughs> <laughs> there's a lot of spheres to spheres, insert. Yeah. Is that a thing in the- god damn it. Oh, another one of these hey. guys. Can I kill it? <laughs> My guys are really slow right now. It looks so happy, it kind of makes me want to kill it too. <laughs> 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 Nothing in a desert is allowed to be this yeah. happy. Damn it, don't run away- god. <laughs> Why are you so happy, huh? Is it the same one that just keeps coming back and mocking you? No, there's a lot of them. That's actually like a Final Fantasy trope, like those- that that specific thing is in like every single Final Fantasy game. Oh, the cactus. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff like that. Yeah, what are the other tropes in every Final Fantasy? <laughs> there's always chocobos. There's, it's pretty much just that. There's always like this like same summons. God damn it! It's so hard to aim on this. Okay, and I didn't even hit him. <laughs> I'll just kill that guy, I guess. Yeah, let's see. Okay, so chocobos, there's the, those cactus things. Um, there's always a guy named Sid in every episode, every uh, installment. A different guy with the same name? 
Yeah, and he's usually actually he's usually like this like a similar type of character in every game. He's in Final Fantasy VII as a playable character. Yeah. Um, just little little stuff like that. There, obviously, like the same spells and the same like magic and stuff. There's always like similar town names. Yeah. I can't. Okay, my guy, Waka just sucks. That's what it all chalks up to. Because my guy that's not even supposed to be able to hit those things, like, hits them before Waka does. <laughs> He's supposed to do this professionally. My guys are losing. I'm doing really bad right now. <laughs> and I only have, I don't have my summoner. Oh yeah, there's always summons in every game. You can, like, summon. They're usually kind of... Pointless, but okay. so does each person start um, kind of with a different ability circle? So right when you get them, each person get it a certain thing. Yeah. Okay. So like, yeah, you have your black mage and your yeah, um, like thief character. It, it looked like each, each person had kind of a different circle highlighted on that ability chart. Yeah. So yeah, actually, they all kind of have a. A pretty linear direction in the beginning but later in the game you can kind of bleed into other places you have to like unlock certain there's like certain certain things you have to unlock to yeah get <laughs> okay yeah and uh what was i just saying i don't know that might be a trap but let's do it <laughs> <laughs> you're gonna fight the starlight now yeah <laughs> i wonder that's that's totally original man <laughs> and how how is it machines? That was clearly like a plant creature down there. God, this arrow is pissing me off. I like that when they feel like something's not original enough, they'll put like an extra mouth on it or something. That <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's the Balrog from Shit! Ah, oh, I just attacked walking. <laughs> Did you see that? Ah! Oh. <laughs> Hopefully it'll motivate him. <laughs> yeah, what if it worked he like is, that? He's like close to death right now. <laughs> I gotta get off my ass and really start helping the team now. Oh, that there's another. Oh, there's a secret to fighting those guys that'll fucking. <laughs> okay, okay. So before hitting the plant, it was a random fight. That's why it was machines. All right, <laughs> that clears that up. <laughs> Yeah, what else we got? There is one character in this game who starts in the middle of the sphere grid, and he, uh, so he, you have the option from the beginning with him to go any way you want him to. And that is this guy right here. So, <laughs> super versatile character right off the bat. Pretty cool. He seems to be pulling the most damage, too. Yeah, I, I had him go the, uh, the strength route. God damn it. My guys are just jacked up right now. Did you like I, uh, <laughs> have any of them like healing? They're both uh, confused right now, which sucks. We don't want. I don't care if Waka dies. It missed, dude. Fucking Kamari. How do you miss with an item? That's bullshit. <laughs> Strength. We threw it too far. Yeah, that's not yeah, supposed yeah. to happen. <laughs> I'm gonna do it again. That's what they changed for the Western audiences. They're making Are it harder. Are you serious? <laughs> Take this! I think it yeah, I think it cured his confusion, so that's good. Dude, I might actually die right now. I have not died once in this game yet, so oh, wow. that would when, not be cool. When's the last time you saved? Oh yeah, that's Well luckily this is an emulator, so I can just go boom, save, bam. You don't have to get to the so it's good now. Okay. <laughs> but normally, yeah, you would have that to save at the sphere issue. grids, which make sure you do that if you're playing this game, which is like 10 years old now. <laughs> but uh, if you haven't, I don't, uh, it's a good game. I'd go back and play it, which I, I actually am right now. Oh, yeah. I'm literally going back and play. It's a good game. I don't know. Don't buy a Hollister. Buy this. Yeah, don't go to Hollister. <laughs> <laughs> Work. It's it's also a funny story how I got the job there. I'm doing awful at this fight right now. <laughs> this is gonna take like the whole episode. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I went in there to uh, actually my friend was trying to get the job at Hollister. I didn't have a job either at the time. 
because I was in like art school. And you don't need jobs when you're in art. Anyway, <laughs> you you do, but <laughs> yeah, it was they do like group interviews there. So like all the like all the interviews were scheduled at the same time, and you all just showed up. And I I went along with my friend for like moral support, and I was like, I'll apply too. Fuck it. Cause it's like a little computer in the store where like anyone can walk up and apply like instantly. Yeah. But anyway, like my whole goal for that interview was to like get like make my friend laugh. <laughs> like, <laughs> so they were asking questions like, "What do you think of diversity and how it relates to like Hollister and stuff like that?" And I was like, um, "I don't think Hollister has a lot of diversity. You guys are pretty much Nazis." And, uh, <laughs> like, I didn't care, but it, yeah, it got everyone to laugh, and I got, I ended up getting hired, and my friend didn't get hired. <laughs> <laughs> After you called him that. Yeah. I don't know, I guess they, uh, eventually my friend did get hired, though, because I was, like, dating my boss. That's... I was like, you should hire, he needs the job, I don't really was care. Was the boss you ended up dating, the one who did the interview? Okay, so, <laughs> no. <laughs> no, that, but I did kind of date we hooked anyway <laughs> she she wasn't working there for much longer after that interview because um she went she went to do the like africa thing and like help kids and whatever that's called it's like the inner it has the name like children of light or you basically just go to like, kenya yeah <laughs> and i'm fighting one of these kill it you bitch damn it so now yeah the the boss that replaced her was the one that I ended up dating. And then I was like, hire this bitch. <laughs> and yeah, it was actually pretty fun because they hired two of my other friends too. <laughs> so at like one point it was like four of my friends and I was like dating the boss. So it was just good times. <laughs> we would get like hammered and just we didn't give a shit about the job. <laughs> That's why we, you we ruined that place. We just ruined that place. So it actually was pretty fun. If you had like an actual job there, and it's a shitty job, but I had fun. <laughs> and yeah, don't go to Hollister. <laughs> What's the best job you've ever had? Oh, clearly like caricatures. I don't know. Oh fuck. I'm fighting another one of these, and I'm not paying attention, so I'm like getting <laughs> ruined. Uh, gotta bring back Waka. I don't- I'd say, yeah, caricatures, as far as, like, retail jobs go, but, like, hands down, like, any commissions I get are usually way better when I'm just, like, doing them at home, yeah. so. Any job that you don't have to What do am I doing? I'm doing nothing right now. Um, I gotta heal. Alright, heal! <laughs> Sorry, there are like, I think it was episode like 38 where I was on, we were on the same fight the whole time and it was me just like scrolling up and down on the menu. <laughs> uh, so I felt pretty bad about that. But I'm thinking though, I'm <laughs> thinking while episode. doing it though, I'm like, which one should I use, that or that? Is it like oh, god damn it, walking. <laughs> Always confused. Yeah. Okay, that just knocked him out of it, so thank you. I'm gonna I don't know why I have him out there still. <laughs> what were we just talking about? I already forgot. Hollister? Oh, the best job you've ever had. Oh. The, all right. I pretty much answered yeah, yeah. that. Do you have a, a best job you've ever had? <laughs> yeah, I guess, I guess the character. Because I've been doing it... Yeah, I've been doing this for eight years now, so I... Every other job I've had, uh, Hollister was my other longest job I've ever had, and it was a year to the day. I quit a year after. God damn it! I like planned it out. It was like after like all my friends left, and my boss got fired, uh -huh. and I was like, I don't, guys, I'm not, I just don't care. I I don't want to be here anymore. <laughs> and they were like, all right, see, ya. they didn't care at all. They have there's like a lot of people that work there. They keep the roster pretty big. What am I game. doing right now? Okay, yeah, I'm fighting. <laughs> God damn it. How about you, Matt? What's the uh, best job you've ever had? You've had a lot. I have. I have had a lot of jobs. Um, it's probably the English teaching thing. Yeah. Just because this was really easy and... Yeah, and it paid all right. That's all I want, really. <laughs> For yeah, I mean, it's, it's like this... No, I mean, I you know, all the, the engineering stuff that I did, it... it 
made really well, but it was massively stressful, so... <laughs> yeah, it sounds kind of intense. Yeah. Oh, damn it! Did I... Okay, I already killed the guy down most, there. Like, the Sorry. Most... Keep oh, going. Okay. <laughs> what would you do? Oh, we got a, we got a cutscene. Okay, so this is the... Uh... Oh, we got some good graphics going on, kind of. That looks like a pre-rendered yeah. background, actually. This is um, Riku's hometown, which is, it looks like a pile of shit. <laughs> so how many people are, are you missing right now? Just one, Yuna, who is the, uh, she's the summoner of the group, or the white mage of the group, and we need her. She's like the main character, who's gonna kill the, the whale thing I was talking about. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, I wonder if Kida got all up in this shit. It seems like they would well I guess like No, this this seems right up their alley. There's yeah. Imaginary whale. You cannot kill that. Yeah. <laughs> it's like completely unacceptable. Aim towards children, training them how to kill whales when they grow up. <laughs> I never even thought of that. That's yeah. actually yeah, like fuck. Big whales. <laughs> they'll they'll, they'll just destroy your town. Use other animals to fight them. Well, and oddly enough, it's it's made in Japan, and that's whale hey. is a big thing there. Oh so. my god, that's probably like why they chose that. Is there? Yeah. You spear them to death, like for the final. <laughs> Dude, I wonder. Maybe they just saw that South Park episode. <laughs> Fuck you, whale. <laughs> We, we just figured out uh, how our, our next Final Fantasy game. Yeah. <laughs> the South Park episodes. <laughs> oh, I was supposed to be coming up with a new idea. I just watched South Park all day. Wait a minute. Yeah, it's real. Well, is it like, because um, most Final Fantasy games, the bad guy, the, usually the final boss is something big ish. Or actually, maybe not. I don't know. Final Fantasy VII, it was, um... <laughs> Sephiroth. One yeah, winged. Yeah, really big, though. Yeah, and he had that goddamn move where that, like, destroys the galaxy. Or, no, Meteor. Yeah. Meteor. Which was, like, a... It was, like, a ten-minute animation every time he did it. <laughs> For Knights of the Round. Oh, God. <laughs> I'm using the summon spell. I better, uh... I better go get <laughs> some food now. Yeah, seriously. <laughs> I was like, yeah, it was powerful, but I, it's not worth it. At <laughs> what cost? There's a. Did you ever play Bayonetta by any chance? Which it's kind of like a newer RPG, but uh, yeah, the final boss and that would hurl galaxies at you, like legit. You know, I I think I, a... I think I could actually withstand that if someone threw a galaxy. It'd be okay. <laughs> You could just live in that galaxy. Yeah. <laughs> I actually, um... <laughs> Everything would pass right by me. Yeah. I'd say, what, what was the point of that? You'd be exactly where you were. <laughs> in a slightly different... I don't know if this is true, but yeah, I heard um, the Andromeda... Well, it's true, but... Um, the Andromeda galaxy, which is like the closest galaxy next to ours, is supposed... Or solar system? I don't know. It's yes. a solar system or galaxy? Uh, galaxy. It's supposed to collide with ours in like a million years or something. It's like on course. Yeah, they'll they'll kind of slam into each other, and I think theirs has the the larger supermassive black hole. So, oh, wow. like their supermassive black hole will consume ours or something like that. So we'll get absorbed in the Andromeda oh. galaxy. Yeah, that's crazy. But I heard um. I heard if like if we're we're not going to be around obviously when it happens, but I heard <laughs> when it does happen, like we will barely notice. We would barely be able to like notice anything different. Like there might be some like tidal <laughs> changes. Tidal I don't know. I guess tidal? it's hard to tell. Tidal like just oh, like bigger waves and shit or smaller. Yeah. <laughs> I was I picturing know. things being renamed. Like tidal. <laughs> <laughs> Our language like, would change. I don't remember it being called McDonald's before. <laughs> <laughs> Just the way we we all become Canadians. <laughs> <laughs> or what was it from um, Idiocracy when Fun Ruckers become Fun Ruckers? Such a good movie. <laughs> <laughs> that was how you can see society going down. 
<laughs> oh, by the way, yeah, we gotta. That's our time. So we'll see you next time on the David Show. Hopefully with more Matt and Tom. Yeah. Bye.